Hello people of the internet, I am your host JCMX and I welcome you guys back to the channel. Today we'll be continuing our Pokemon Sword for the Nintendo Switch Poor Man Run Challenge playthrough. And uh, this is going to be episode 7 of our playthrough so far. Um, it's the quick recap from last episode. We got through Route 3, we managed to catch uh, one new member. Not of our party because he went to the box, we cut him a chop. And uh, today we'll be exploring this tunnel. But before that, it's been a while since I've done a, a recap of the team real quick. So we got Didi, the uh, flying... Uh, Rook... Rookie D Pokemon. Uh, we got... Uh, Howet, How Howlet, the Chulet, Chouette. We got uh, Price, the Meowth. He, the special Meowth that we got from the one... Uh, the mystery gift. Uh, then we got Cherry, the Cherubi. We got uh, Blaze, the recently evolved Raboot, who uh, looks like a Boruto ninja. Then we got Glob or Wooper. Let's look at him or, or her, all smiley. And that is the party so far right now. Um, and they're all topped up and ready to go. We got a free heal last time from this wonderful lady right here. So, so far we haven't used any of our five tokens in the entire run of the game so far. Which is not, not bad. Okay, so this is the Galar Mind. Meaning, we can catch a new Pokemon. And since our... Ooh! Timber? Or not... not is it Timber? Oh no, I don't like how those... Those diglets pop in and out. They can, attack me out of nowhere. Is that a minecart? Pokemon? Oh, another item we can trade in. Aww. Okay, let's see. Who's your work partner? Kate. Ooh, a rock and roll. I actually love Gigalit. It's one of my favorite Pokemon, especially the shiny version. God, it's so good. Uh, unfortunately, we cannot get a Rock and Rolla because I can't trade due to the Nuzlocke stuff. So unfortunate. But I wouldn't mind. I mean, if we can find an uh, Eviolite, the second form would be pretty uh, physically defensive and good acid to the team. Two shot, nice. Come on, Hellet. You, you gotta, you gotta start carrying some weight. If not, I'm gonna have to like, replace you pretty soon. Level. Yes. Good. Good. Zero defense. Oh my god, my team. Not. I learned protect. You just gained so much more value on my team. DD level 16. Nice average. Two one 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 one. Once you earn pluck. Good move. I believe it's stronger than Peck, right? Yes. Um, am I ever going to use Power Trip? I think I'll use it more than Fury Attack, so. Let's get rid of Fury Attack. Get that Pluck. Yep. Not, in, not as in sync as my party. Cool, cool, cool. Let's use a potion and howlet. Caesar. Something hidden over here? Or is this the way that you're supposed to go? Well, there's a Pokeball. Good item. Great balls. Good, 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 good. More free items, more free items. Is this the right way to go? I guess not, but hey, we found a TM. That works for me. Rock Blast. Eh, decent little move. Not like amazing. And I don't think we have a Pokemon yet that can really utilize that move. But hey, TMs are TMs. We gotta collect them all, right? Okay. I guess we'll just keep going down the road. 
Seeing as how we're into mine and stuff, I think most of their mons aren't going to be... Um, they're probably going to be like rock and ground, so maybe I should use cherry a bit here. Since it should have an advantage around the Pokemon in this place. And they send a fighting type, which I could have done well with my <laughs> flying type. <sighs> okay, she has three mons, so I'm gonna try to set up. Hopefully he doesn't do too much damage immediately. Is that lower speed? No. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh no, that's gonna do more. See how much we heal with Morning Sun? We're inside a cave, so I don't think we'll heal that much, right? Oh, back to full. Okay, so probably just half. How much is that? Seven? Okay, we can set up a little bit more. I know this isn't the most uh, hype way to win battles, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? And like, I don't think Cherry has like the greatest stats, so probably plus four, which I think I'm at right now, should be good enough to sweep the three mods. I'm just gonna use, um, let's try it. Hello? Okay, so Cherry just does no damage whatsoever, apparently. I am at plus four special, plus four physical. Stab, by the way. Higher level, and it didn't even do half. You know what I miss? The in Sun and Moon, you could see little arrows on top of your Pokemon on the on the stat thing to tell you uh, like um, how many boosts and stuff you have. Like, can I still see that? I guess not. So I guess it's back to the old days where you have to keep track of the stat. But it's also like kind of screwed up because if he crits me, it he could potentially just. Take me out. Oh, and that would work. I'm pretty sure even a crit Loki won't do me in. So we'll go for Burning Sun and attempt to finish it off with one more Leaf Surge. It still didn't finish it? Wow. Oh my god. Cherry, come on. All that setup. All that build up. Okay, Chewit might stay in the party. I might get rid of Cherry. Is she just gonna have three timbers? <laughs> oh cool, good thing I healed. I have one more heal, so I'm gonna take one hit, heal. God, I'm a plus six! Let me check this out. 40? 40. Crit! Nope. I got crit in return, okay. On tackle should do the trick. Please have a rock type as your last mod so I could just one shot it. Please. <sighs> Not surprised. Not surprised. even have this just baffles me plus six 
plus six. Oh well, I mean, it is a Cherubi, like, it, it's not like the greatest Mon. But still, I mean, I had a little bit of faith, right? Like. Oh well, well, at least Cherry made it through. Yeah. It's not possible way we can miss, right? Yep. Nice and simple. Well, not simple. Not nice, actually. Very long battle for no reason. Didn't even level up. At least Prize did. Well, she seems really happy to be to lose. Um, I guess it was just fun battle. Get you, get you. Work does get boring sometimes. Strike Glob. We don't give it enough love. Oh, there's that rock Pokemon. There's that Woobat over there, I think. But I saw something in this tracks earlier, like like a minecart that was just moving moving along. So I'm gonna exit. Right? And then go back inside. There it is. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, come back. Come back. Just vanishes. I'm gonna try to catch it. You, you, you might need like a bike or like the ability to run faster, but I'm gonna try anyways. Oh no! Oh my god. Well, I guess this is our encounter for the cave. It looks like a rock type, but if it can't live a water gun, then it's like, is it really worth adding to the team? Well, it has smoke screen. Is it a fire type? Because if it's a fire type, it might not survive a water gun. Let's see. No, it, it lives it fine, so it's either rock or ground. But it just happens to have smoke screen for whatever reason. Interesting animation for that move. Um, use. One, two, three. Triple jiggle catch on the first try. Let's go. Roly Coley. I kind of want it on the team, not gonna lie. Oh, I really want to get rid of Cherry now to add this Mon. Yep, pure rock. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, what's a cool nickname for a rock? Rock wheel. Uh... Um, I guess, I mean, this is not like the greatest name, but I like it. It's, it's really simple. Because, you know, it has a wheel, so it, it can win races, kind of like Patrick's Pet Rock. I think it was named Rocky, right? The one that, like, from that one episode from Spongebob that ends up winning the race. Because it was, somehow it moved when Gary and uh, Squid, Squidward's uh, uh, snail were doing their thing. So I'm gonna name it Rocky, in honor of Rocky the Rock. Oh, I really wanted that minecart looking guy. Uh, play this way. 
Ooh, another TM. Scary face. Wow, that's a pretty garbage feel. I guess I'll heal Hella since we might need it. <laughs> oh no! Okay, if you say so. Sandra. Don't wink at me like that. Give these people the wrong idea. I wonder, does this work? Don't you dare flinch me. Well, they're gonna go! I, I was asking if this would work because uh, uh, Glob has damp, so it gets rid of weather effects when it. I guess only when it comes into battle. So that's good to know because I was like, oh maybe water. I mean rain dance isn't gonna be as valuable if it if I get rid of my own. Ooh, I like this little dude. Jobber. A lot of damage. Just, it's so weird. Why does Rapid Spin give speed now? Man, it does so much damage. Like, wasn't it like a 20 base move before? I need to catch something with Rapid Spin so I can look at the move. Oh, they're gone! Let's go. Good job, Bob. Coming through. Ooh, ha, ha. That's about how they sound in my head. I'm sorry for that, but not really sorry. Right? Let's see. Damn. Oh, never mind. It does something completely different. It prevents things from blowing up in my face. So, borderline useless. <sighs> I like my uh There it goes again, you see? Right there, that cart Pokemon. Is it like the evolution of Rocky? Wow, this guy's blind as a bat. Heavy duty boots. The boots prevents the effect of traps set on the battlefield. So like Huh, interesting. So I wonder if that works against um, um, T spikes and spikes. Like, would you just not get affected by them? Because if that's the case, that's a pretty useful, useful item, I guess. Depending on, I guess it depends on how the meta evolves. Because spikes are gonna be all that relevant or not. Many mods. One? Okay, we're not gonna set up. Um, rain dance this turn. Lower its speed. Do a decent amount of damage. Hopefully, we we'll outspeed it on the second go around. Come on, Glob, go! Yes! Saving that HP. Easy, easy, easy. <laughs> Level 15 for Hewlett and level 17 for Didi. Didi's growing pretty fast. This is the highest level mod on my party now. Obviously, um, Blaze is right behind it. Like any tiny amount of XP will level up um, Blaze, but. Oh, another item. Another trade in item. Not bad for us. Not bad. Uh, potions? Super potions, okay, I'll take it. Ooh! Hey, I remember you from the challenge thing. Oh, so it's an important battle, it seems. Okay. 
Okay, okay. So, in that's the case. We're gonna start with our fake out user. And now I'm going to give my Pokemon some berries. You know, you can never be too careful. Um. Should be good enough. You wanna go? Just because a Sherman put you in the league tournament? I was chosen by the Sherman him himself, so that makes me more amazing than me. What? You wish. Oh, you don't even tell us your name. Oh, that's a little cool turtle. Uh, Bidi? Bede. Bidi. I'm just gonna call him slash her Bidi. Ooh, Solosis. Meow. Fake out. Okay. Destroy this man. Slash. Crit him for insult. Nope. Come on, prize. Let's go. Blaze. 17. Also, oh, seems like this trainer specializes in psychic types. Interesting. Crit. No crit. Take with me. No. My attack? My defense? But if you crit, you ignore the stat reduction. No crit. Prize! Why do you keep letting me down? It's really simple. You go, you hit him really, really hard, and they go down. Simple, right? <sighs> the zero for four. Hit him with that payday. Cash money. I don't know if you guys saw that, but my, my trainer moved its hand. Just some cash. Another level. That's your last mon. Yeah, what have you been doing? Ooh, what is this? Looks like a little clown. Is it a pre-pre-evolution to, uh, Mr. Mime Jr.? Um... Well, since I'm at, like, minus three, I'm just gonna swap. It shouldn't be too powerful. It looks like a baby Pokemon. Yeah, not too, too powerful. Ooh. I don't understand why uh, Hewlett is so fast. Like, it's a turtle, right? Shouldn't it be, like, super slow? But, like, watch this. Uh, I don't understand. Why, are, why is Hewlett so fast? Price level 16, Glob level 16. Trying to learn bite. Yes, please. Goodbye, Scratch. Put you on the bite. Glob wants to learn slam. Yes, please. Get rid of that uh, tail whip. I'll keep Rain Dance just in case. You never know when you need to change the weather. BD gone. Oh yeah? You weren't really trying? Oh 
Oh, well, that was unexpected. I suppose you're more than able than I thought. Hell yeah, we are. Bye! Huh? Seems grumpy. Bag of Stardust. We're just getting all these items that we can sell for cash. But unfortunately, we cannot buy items from Pokemon shops till we beat a gym. And if I'm correct, this big stadium looking thing is a gym. Is this the sister for that one girl? Yep. Heal me for free, please. Woohoo! Let's go. So we're in Route 4, we're fully healed. Um, and we are ready. It's another camp. I'm not gonna look at that one. It's a Pikachu trainer running around over there. Energy, uh, healing item. I'll take it. I know it makes the Pokemon not like me. Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'll shake it like once, and if the tree starts shaking, I won't shake it anymore because I don't want that squirrel as my encounter. No, just once. Get that lepo, the cherry and lepo berries, and call it a day. I don't want that squirrels the encounter. I do want like a new mon. Whoa, what are you? A meowth? But I have a meowth. Okay, now this is a big dilemma. Because technically it's species, so I can choose not to catch it, but it looks so cool. And it's the exact same level of surprise. Okay, this, uh... Ooh! I wanna... It looks so cool with, like, that beard. It looks like a fucking chupacabras. Um... I'm gonna call Species Claws on this. Uh, for those who don't know, Species Claws is literally like if you catch the same Mon that. Um, the same species of Mon, like an evolution of some Pokemon that you already have, or pre evolution, or the same Mon shows up, you know, you can choose to not catch it because you technically already have that Mon and it's repeated. But Electrike, on the other hand, is a completely new Mon. So, we're gonna try to catch this. It's a female. Why would I call a female like that? Triple Jiggle easy catch? No! Triple Jiggle not catch. And he paralyzes me. Bite. Hopefully, it doesn't kill it. Please, meow. Thank you. Perfect. Thanks, Price. Triple Jiggle Easy Catch. Come on. One. Wow. I might use a Grateful thing. Nah, I might as well use Pokeballs right now because the Pokemon are just going to keep getting harder to catch with regular Pokeballs. So. One. Electric, come on! No, no, I misclicked! Paralyze! No! <laughs> well. Ah, I was mashing A too fast! Well, we lost the opportunity to catch Electric and the opportunity to catch him on in Route 4. Ah, oh, should have just gone with the Meowth at this point. <laughs> <sighs> well, that is very sad. Ah, what a waste! 
What a waste. Oh, I didn't even read this guy's text. Oh, he has a heal ball. Jamie. Oh, it's the new meow. But we're here with the OG. The real, the non-fake. Price. The princess. Wow, they did like no damage. Crit! Yes! Is that a crit? Yes! Let's go, prize! That's my princess! Crit, 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 crit! Ah, no crit. This doesn't seem to have any like new moves. Uh, it's at least neutral to normal. Oh no! He used a potion! Uh. Well, let's see, is this not very effective? Are you a dark type? No, it's neutral. So it's not like a lowland meow. Cause it's Are you like normal ground? Or are you just like normal but you have a different ability? Ooh, Butterfree, level 15. Not bad. Hit him with that crit! Come on, Price. No crit? No miss? No. Are we about to take this 50 50? Yeah, because one if I break through, it wins the battle. Yeah, let's go, Price! And little princess. Price level 17, Hewitt level 16, uh, DD level 18, and Cherry level 17. I really wanted to get rid of Cherry. You already know that if we did catch that, um, that Electrike, we we're gonna change it in a heartbeat. Let's let, let's let our new Blaze hit the field. It hasn't been here since it evolved. Look at him! He's straight out of Boruto! Amber? Spitting bars? Oh no! Oh, but we dodge it! Skillfully dodge it! Boom! New move? No, nothing. We need to learn a physical fire type move like Blaze Kick, Fire Punch. Oh, let's go! DD evolving. Second evolution for the team. Let's go. DD evolve into Corvish Squire? Corvish Squire? Is it still pure flying? Yes, pure flying. Ooh, nice. Mm, yeah, this is a potion and prize. Let's check out our Corvus Squire DD. Still has keen eye, so it's not gonna be missing any moves, or at least get even less accurate. Seems to be pretty fast, um, but not as fast as Blaze, and not as strong as Blaze. We both have the same amount of HP, and Blaze even has more defense. So, Corby Knight, besides the pure flying type, or not Corby Knight, Corby Squire doesn't uh, seem to be that big of an asset to the team. Electric, no! Stop! Okay, well with that, I think with that evolution, we're going to be wrapping up today's episode. Uh, thanks so much for coming and watching the video. Uh, if you liked the video, feel free to leave a like. Uh, comment down below what was your favorite part. 
and I hope to see you guys tomorrow for the next episode. Uh, so once again, thanks a lot for watching. You guys are awesome, and I hope to see you go to see you all tomorrow. Bye.